What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is the free general collective reading, Caps through Sage, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Um, I received a channeled message. Um, I went to bed real early last night like an old woman, the 38-year-old woman I am. So, I'm up early. <laughs> Just saying. So, um, we're starting early this morning at 6.23 a.m. Central Standard Time on 3-18-2022. So, we're going to do it. Um, it's a free general collective reading. So, it's very important to only take the messages that resonate, leave the rest. If it's not your story, please don't. Please don't force it. Please don't. Because I've... Uh, by the way, yesterday was the two-year anniversary of my channel. Just saying that. Yesterday, two years, just saying. So, um, I'm still, the point is, is even after two years of being on YouTube and reading, I'm still getting messages saying, well, it's not my story. It's not my story. Well, for those of you that's reaching out saying that, I've said it again. I'll say it again. It's a free general collective reading. You're not getting a personal reading. So if it's not your story, it's not your story. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Okay? I mean, I just don't know what else to say about that. Okay? All right. So the channel message I received was um, a, a very wealthy, wealthy and abundant karmic, ma karmic masculine energies and open relationships um are about to um dating three or more people is what i heard specifically dating three or more people um are about to have huge tower moments in their lives um these karmic masculine individuals are about to find out they have impregnated several people um at least three people some some of these masculine energies have been impregnated up to five people um that is what i heard what just saying just saying uh, oh my gosh um you plug it in how it resonates i just don't know what to say about that um that's gonna be a i heard they're very wealthy um, they're masculine energy, so they have penile parts. Um, some of them might have, you know, femme and masculine parts, but definitely a penis to impregnate for sure. But, and they're very wealthy. So, I mean, they're not in the poor house. They're not in the poor house. I don't know if it's trust fund baby energy, inheritance energy, will energy, um, or if it's been working hard through our entire life, or they have nice professional careers that make a lot of money, and that's why they're wealthy. I mean, there's at least two of these individuals in the universe. So, you know, their story is their story. Only they know their story, not anybody else. But my point is, just because you're wealthy, and those of you who've been watching my channel a hot minute, you know this, but just because you're wealthy doesn't mean you're high vibrational. And whoever these masculine dudes are, now how old they are, I have no idea. But it's... They're wealthy, yes, but they're very low vibrational. They're going around dating all these people. And I mean, it sounds like karma is about to come around and backfire on them in a huge way in the form of all these pregnancies. That's exactly what my intuitive take logic and reasoning on this is. They thought they could, I feel they have like God complexes. And I didn't hear they had God complexes, but it sure seems like it. They're wealthy. They know they're wealthy. I'm sure they're damn good looking. Um, they're obviously good looking enough to date all these people. People want to date them. I don't know if it's because they have money or they're good looking or both, but they're, if they're not good looking, they're probably not half bad to look at. Um, just saying, just saying. Um, but I feel they might have like God complexes. Um, I didn't hear they did, but that's my take on this. Um, but I, I, it sounds like it's negative karma from the universe about to give them a huge ass wake up call because Yes, they're wealthy, and yes, they're confident, and yes, that they're laying their sex wand all over the universe in these open relationships. And, you know, I'm not judging anybody. If you want to be in an open relationship, you go with your bad self. 
I mean, I am not an open relationship kind of person. I never have been. Even when I was dating, 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 I made it very clear. I wasn't like that. Um, and that's just the truth. But, um, but I feel it like it's negative karma about to come around and give them a wake up call in the form of their pocketbook when they have to go into court for a child. Or, well, that some of them might have to go into court for child support. Some may not. I don't know if the state's just going to handle it or what have, I don't know. Everybody's situation is different, but when they, their bank account starts draining because all these child supports coming out, that's, I feel it's going to be negative karma for them is what I'm trying to say. I mean, some of them up to five people pregnant. Some three. I mean, I heard three and five specifically in the channel messages. Um, some of them dating up to three people. Some got up to five people pregnant. So meaning they'd have to date up to five people. That's a lot of child support. I don't care how wealthy you are. That's a lot of freaking child support, man. Um, and if they are married, legally married, that's grounds for divorce, man. Um, that's, that's super grounds for divorce. I'm just saying, just saying. Oh, man. You plug it in, how it resonates. This is wild. This is wild. I... <laughs> We have beginnings on the bottom of the deck. Number two might be a very significant number. Number two. Some of these feminine energies have been pregnant a while and they're about to contact this masculine energy. Some are about to find out they're pregnant. Okay, some of the feminine energies have been pregnant a while. They're about to contact the masculine energy. Um, and some, they just about they just found out they're pregnant. Um, so... The ones that have been pregnant for a while, I'm not sure why they haven't reached out. Um, if you're the femme energy that's been pregnant for a while and you're about to reach out to this masculine energy, only you know your story, not anybody else. So, I mean, not, no judgments here, no judgments. But some have been pregnant for a while, I heard, and they're about to reach out to the masculine energy. Some are about to find out they're pregnant. But there is at least two masculine energies in the universe that have a lot of money, basically. Very low vibrational Sex wine energy all over the universe, and they are about to basically get hit child support wise. I'm feeling, and I didn't hear they're going to get hit child support wise, but I mean, they should be. And I'm serious. And if they're married, I hope they get a divorce and the, um, the spouse takes what they rightfully deserve. And I'm serious. Okay, we have beginnings. Number two could be a very significant number in one's life. Number two, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number. Possible day of birth number, possible green card number, possible jersey number. Um, number two, beginnings. Cycles are about to change quick. A lot of people were very mentally manipulated. They're seeing very, very, very clearly they're about to take some serious action. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So a lot of people were very man mentally manipulated, I heard. So basically like mindfuck energy. Um, they were mindfuck, basically. Um, this could be you or somebody you're connected to. Only you know your story, not anybody else. So you might know this masculine energy that has laying his sex wand all over the universe. Or you might be a femme energy that was impregnated by him. Or you might be somebody connected to the femme energy that was pregnated by, impregnated by him or the masculine energy that is wealthy. However, that resonates, but it sounds like a lot of people were mind, mind fucked basically by this masculine energy and this situation, whether he is legally married or not. But I heard basically there must, uh, some I feel have already started seeing clearly, some they're about to, and it, it's about to start cycle changing quick. So that to me is the beginnings energy here, See, um, getting out of the mind fog, getting out of the mental fog, putting your big girl panties on, your big boy pants on, and seen clearly cycle changing and new beginning energy here because i feel i feel some of you guys this message is for you might be connected to these people and you were mentally mind fucked because there's a reason i got a me that message and i think it's this masculine energy that was mentally mind fucking these people so i don't think these me um that specific message is for him i think it's for you guys that's connected to this hot mess express because this is a hot mess express, you guys. Um, this is whatever the I mean, whoever the hell this is for. 
this is a hot mess express but i think you the message for you guys connected to this is what i'm saying so be, seeing things clearly is what i'm feeling here you're about to cycle change and you're about to see things clearly here uh, the whoo dear god okay i'm leaving that right there i'm gonna pull some kipper whoo this is something man I heard keep shuffling. We have pathway open on the bottom of the deck. Um, I heard keep shuffling, but uh, in number 32, I'm sorry, 35 could be a very significant number in one's life. But I feel the pathway is open for you guys that are about to start cycle changing and seeing things clearly. I just want to say that real quick. Um, I, and probably the pregnant people, um, because whoever this is for, you either know you're not the only one or you're about to find out you're not the only one pregnant. And I'm serious about that. I am so serious. Um, fem energies uh, with baby bumps or about to find out you have a baby bump. Um, I'm serious. But I think your pathway's open and clear. Maybe you're going to communicate with people. Maybe you're going to take some action. But your pathway's clear. Your pathway's open here. I don't think this is for this karmic masculine wealthy energy. I think this is for... Either the pregnant people connected to him or um, people connected to the pregnant people or people connected to him. If, you know, they basically are real with him and tell him he's freaking like, what the hell are you doing, man? Like, do you think that's the smartest thing? I mean, ew. One of these karmic masculine energies has a very severe STD. And it's about to create negative series of chain of events for him, legally. Oh, oh my God. Oh, this is getting more terrible. Okay, one of these karmic masculine wealthy energies has STD. I heard a pretty rough one. I don't know. I didn't hear specifically what STD it is, but um, it's, it sounds like it's up there on the totem pole and STDs. I'm just saying. Um, so whatever the crap it is, you plug it in, how it resonates. Um, but I heard it's about to create a um, negative series of chain of events for him in the legal sector. So I think somebody's about to take his ass to court for giving them STD. I wonder if, I wonder if for one of them is the HIV. And I'm serious. Um, and maybe, maybe they have HIV. Maybe it acquired AIDS. You know, maybe it, um, yeah. Uh, this is, oh, this is something. Mm. Spirit messages you have for this life. This is something, something, something. Oh, oh my God, yes. The um, I feel this whole community is about to get affected. A whole community is about to get very negatively affected. Um by some masculine karmic masculine energy child reverse um and change you can't make this crap up even if you wanted to um i think the karmic masculine energy is about to um negatively affect the community i mean he's already negatively affected at least three people's lives in some cases some five i mean up to five people pregnant at a time that is crazy that is that to me okay you guys i just want to say this real quick before we keep going that is okay you hear about baby mama baby daddy energy and i don't judge i've never been a baby mama or baby daddy i was married when i had my kids and it was very committed marriage and blah 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 um but and I don't, but I don't judge the baby mama, baby daddy energy is what I'm saying. I don't, um, it's not my place to judge, but this is like baby mama, baby daddy energy amplified times like a hundred. I mean, five people pregnant at a time. Um, these people are going to find out about the other people. 
how can they not if they live in the same community? I, some of them may not live in the same community. Maybe for some of these masculine karmic wealthy masculine energies, they travel and they're able to hide it. Um, but I feel for some, they might live in the same community. And I'm so serious about that. I'm so serious. Number nine or 18 could be very significant numbers in one's life. Nine or 18. It could be possible ages of viewers might be connected to. Uh, possible lottery number. Possible day of birth number. Possible green card number. Possible jersey number. Nine or 18. Nine could be a possible age of a child as well. Maybe it's the age of one of these. Uh, maybe it's the age of a child already connected to one of these pregnant people. Um, or the karmic masculine wealthy energy possibly. I didn't hear it was, but maybe. Change. Five, 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 energy. The information is about to come out very quickly. And cycle changes are about to happen quickly. Okay, so that's double confirmation on cycle changes. We heard it in the beginnings card message. And we heard it in the change card. And we have change and beginnings. Um... This is confirmation in the cards and the messages. Cycle changes, confirmation, double confirmation times two in here. Um, cycle changes quickly here. So I feel the cycle change energy is the other pregnant people finding out about the other pregnant people. And I feel in some of these situations, I heard some of them are already pregnant. And they've been pregnant for a while. They just haven't said anything. And some are about to find out they're pregnant. So in some of these cases, they have up to three people pregnant at a time. Some five people. Um you know, you plug it in how it resonates, but cycle changes times two, change with beginnings, um, coupled with the child card. So I'm thinking <laughs> the other people are about to find out about the other people is what I'm thinking. Or family members are about to find out about the other pregnant people connected to this karmic wealthy masculine energy. I, I feel it's information flow about to get all over the universe is what I'm trying to say. This is not something I feel can be contained. Um, maybe this this person, it seems like they have a God complex. I didn't hear they did, but it really seems like they do. The karmic, masculine, wealthy energy. Um, but I and I and people with God complexes, they feel they can control everything. I mean, I'm just being for real. They do. They feel they can control every damn thing. But... This is not something I feel they can control. And in fact, I know it's not because of the spiritual downloads. It's not something they can control. Can control. I think they thought they could. It is about to blow up quickly. Tower moments coming all over the place soon. Oh my goodness. I heard it is about to blow. And I heard that bit. Blow up quickly tower moments coming all over the place soon so blow up energy loud and proud um, and quickly so tower moments is a blow up energy communication change cycle changes i mean i feel this is communication all over the airways people calling people blah blah blah, blah. maybe it's the uh, pregnant people calling the other pregnant people that when they find out that they're pregnant by this person too um, maybe it's communication if some of them are legally married with a legally uh, married wife. I didn't hear any of these were legally married, but maybe they are. It could be, to me, I feel it could be communication with a legally married wife or my, uh, or husband. Um, it could be communication with the other pregnant feminine energies. It could be communication with family members of these pre, uh, pregnant feminine energies, family members of the karmic masculine energy. Other community members that know about this situation, it could be co-worker energy, it could be anything. But I'm feeling community energy here. I, I mean, cycle changes quick, 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 quick. I mean, double confirmation on cycle changes with the change card. I mean, holy smokes, a mighty man. This is, whoa. Okay, so child reverse. Children already here on earth are about to get very angry when they find about found out find out about this situation. 
of other people acting out one of these karmic masculine energies is going to attempt to pay off some of these people for abortions however many shocking series of chain events are going to occur in this situation and these a lot of these feminine energies are going to refuse the abortion money they know it will not be smart for them or their situation holy crap well there's the tower moments for these karmic masculine energies um there you go holy crap okay so children are okay so that that explains the child reverse so this is dual energy this is children acting up i think this karmic Matt mary um not married karmic masculine wealthy energy i think some of them have already have children i think their kids are about to find out about some of these pregnant people and it's going to cause them to act out child reverse in this situation is the acting out child in one situation that's how i feel it can go um, in one situation Ch children acting out in another situation could be some of the other pregnant people that maybe they have children current children and their children are going to start acting out when they find out their mom is pregnant by somebody they have no clue who it is or barely know maybe um or children acting out connected to the pregnant feminine energies when they find out they're pregnant by this wackadoo um, and same goes with the masculine energy when maybe it's children connected to him like family members cousins um family um etc 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 when they find out they have impregnated all these people in the freaking universe um so children acting out energy strong i feel it can go dual energy for both you know the pregnant feminine energies um and this karmic masculine wealthy energy um i'm serious um that's that's crazy in one situation now the other situation the karmic wealthy masculine energy one of them because there's at least two in the universe is going to uh i heard going to offer a very large it's basically hush money they're gonna offer a huge ass amount of hush money to offer some of these pregnant feminine energies to get abortions basically so basically to terminate in this instance one is child acting out energy child reverse the other one is abortion energy possible abortion energy but i heard a lot of these feminine energies so maybe i feel a lot of these messages are for you pregnant feminine energy and i'm serious about that um or you might be a family member of the pregnant feminine, feminine energy how that resonates or a friend but how that resonates um i heard a lot of them aren't, aren't going to do it they're going to actually going to refuse the money and that's exactly what i would do um, because i heard it would not benefit your situation and yeah because it's probably going to give you mental health issues if you accept the hush money to go get the abortion down the line because you know what you did i wouldn't do it either and i'm serious but of course you have free will and you can choose to do what you want to do but i heard a lot of you guys aren't going to accept it so it sounds like maybe one or two in the universe might accept it but of course you have free will in your own choice so i feel for a lot of you guys you are going to um you're not going to accept it some may and some are not um a lot of you guys are not so maybe one or two may but a lot of you guys are not because i heard it will not benefit your situation so you're not going to accept the hush money and i heard it's a hell of a lot of money that he's going to offer you i mean he's got plenty of it so money's not an issue to him i mean i'm feeling god complex energy over here and i'm serious money's not a fucking issue to him so i mean hell he could he, he can do what he fucking wants to do because money's freedom to him which money is freedom to a lot of people but that's how he uh, he handles it on the dark side so but i heard a lot of you guys are not going to accept it so you're going to keep the child and because it's going to benefit you down the line and if i was you i'd keep the child and i'd fall for some damn child support legally through the um court system and i'm serious about that because this is not something you can just cover up with money because if you accept of course you can do what you want but i'm just telling you my thoughts on this if you accept this hush money and you get the abortion you might have severe mental Ill health issues down the line knowing that you terminated a child in your womb i mean i'm serious about that um of course that is your own free will choice to make okay i'm not telling you what to do wow 
and that's change energy energy too because i heard serious tower moments coming for this karmic masculine wealthy energy it's going to create a huge ass tower moment when you do not accept the hush money the uh, hush money slash abortion money over here because his goal is to shut you up his goal is to shut you up and to get this child out of your womb so he is not connected financially or legally to you in any shape form or fashion down the line is what it sounds like here but when you refuse the money it will change the cycle because it's not going to go the way he wants it to go because he's been trying to control this whole situation so much but now the universe is forcing it not to be controlled because I feel like people about to find out about other people being pregnant by this dude. I mean, some three people, some up to five people pregnant at a time. I mean, it is the universe is about to force this shit. But you also have personal power in this two pregnant person. I feel a lot of you guys are about to use your personal power. And I'm serious about that. So kudos to you, feminine energies. Um, but of course, I'm not telling you what to do. You only have your own free will. I mean, you have your own free will to do what you want to do. Okay? Just so you know. Let me see if I hear anything else. Wow, man. Holy crap. It's going to piss this masculine energy off so bad when you do not accept the hush money and the abortion money. Know this. But you have to do it. Well, do what's best for you. Oh, my God. Woo. Okay, I heard it's going to um, piss this. Ma okay, so this message I feel is for pregnant people or people connected to the pregnant people. You plug it in how it resonates. But um, I heard it's going to piss the masculine energy off so bad. The very wealthy, masculine, God complex energy dude. Um, so bad when you do not accept the hush money slash abortion money. Um, but it's going to piss him off um, because you know you, you need to do what's best for you. And absolutely, absolutely. But it's going to piss him off because he's trying to control this situation. He wants to change it in his benefit, i.e. abortion energy, hush money energy. He it was trying to control it at the beginning, but now it's blowing up. He's trying to control it again. But you refusing the hush money, it doesn't give him power and control in this situation. It gives you power and control. So it's going to piss him off because he won't be able to control. And he won't be able to initiate the goal he's trying to do, which is to control it again. Because um, obviously he loves power, control, and sex. So you plug it in how it resonates. Wow, man. Oh, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. That's what I would do. Um, especially knowing he's a very wealthy energy. That's exactly what I would do. I'd keep the baby in a New York minute if I knew he was a um, wealthy dude. In a New York minute. And I'm not a gold digger. I'm absolutely not a gold digger. But if you produce the child, you should pay the child support. And that's just the truth. I mean, anybody that knows me knows I'm a furthest away from a gold digger as there is because I, don't, I get very, very, very minimal child support. Very minimal. My ex-husband, um, he, he doesn't make much. Um, because he just doesn't make much because he doesn't work. So, I mean, um, so I'm not a gold digger, but if I was in this situation and I was impregnated by a wealthy masculine energy, and obviously, you know, he's very wealthy. He obviously loves to splay it around the universe that he is. Um, I would keep it because I feel a lot of you guys are highly intuitive. And I think you're about to pick up on the fact he's trying to control you with the money. Because that's exactly what he's trying to do. So if I was in your situation, I, I, I wouldn't want him to try to troll me any further. So I'd keep it. And I'm serious. But you plug it in how it resonates. Everybody has their own decisions to make. I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices. And namaste. I hope this helped.